Hey guys, this is Noah's Gaming PCs with another quick how to uh, tutorial. Let's say that you have a low end gaming computer or low end uh, computer and you want to record some of your gameplay across some different games that you play. So um, the, to -co the to go place is OBS Studio. Most of us use o OBS Studios. But again, um, you may not have the best computer, uh, but you still want to record. So I'm going to show you guys some settings. I'm going to get straight to the chase. So open up your OBS, click where it says settings, file, or click the settings button here on the bottom right. Um, first things first, um, go to general tab. I like this theme called dark. There, uh, by default, when you install OBS, it just looks cleaner and easier to read. So I, my recommendation, this is just optional. You don't have to do that. Go with the dark theme. Uh, next thing you'll want to do, since this is a low-end uh, computer, you want to set the process. Uh, you got to go to the advanced tab here under settings and go where it says process priority. Put above normal. That way your CPU will give priority to the OBS studio and you'll be able to record your gameplay at a, a better uh, uh, FPS. Um, next thing you want to do is, of course, set up any of your hot keys. Um, so the start recording button, you can just set that up with one of the key, one of the buttons on your keyboard, whatever works for you. Next thing you want to do is go to videos and oh yeah, I'm not able to change this um, because I'm recording right now, but um, that's okay. Uh, basically you want to set your common FPS value, set it to 60. You want to try to record at 60 frames per second. Uh, your t the top one here, base canvas resolution, set it to your monitor's uh, current resolution. In most cases, it will be 1920 by 1080p unless you play on higher resolution. And for the output scaled resolution, since you have a low-end computer, I would change this to the 720p. So look for something that says 720 or some number here, X. 720 that's the uh, 720p that's still considered high definition uh, but it's going to be easier for your processor your cpu to render the images as you're recording and you're playing games at the same time uh, so make sure you do that i've explained that and of course set this to um, 60 frames per second um, audio leave untouched go with the defaults output this is where you're going to go to output mode by default it will be set to simple so you want to change this to advanced I already have advanced here and then the next thing you'll want to do is go to recording tab since we're talking about recording and what you'll do is uh, under the you leave everything as default but um, I would recommend .mp4 as your recording format so you can set that over here under video encoder you want to set this to uh, x286 I believe uh, X286 yes yes I believe that's right that's your CPU or the X286 software that's your CPU so we're gonna have our CPU render yes your CPU may be a low end but uh, just wait you'll be able to do these settings as I, I as I have explained I'm gonna try to provide some screenshots at the end of this so you can make sure that you follow everything again I'm recording with OBS so it's not letting me make changes leave this the same rescale output just leave this the same 10, 1920 by 1080p uh, and then scroll down here and then under CB uh, rate control make sure you select CBR and set your bit rate to um, 4500 kilobytes per second again I'm going to show you screenshots at the end of the video um, this you want to leave at zero your preset you want to go with ah, I forgot what it is, but I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys a screenshot at the end. Uh, profile should be high, I believe, and then that's pretty much it. Um, you're gonna insert here under the AMF slash FFMPEG options. You're gonna set these options like here. So oh, I'm sorry, I said it's actually X x264 that's these that's the setting again watch the screenshots at the end of this you're gonna copy and paste this I'm gonna put this in the video description you're gonna play copy and paste that into these options here and after for example you paste it there you're gonna type space and then you're gonna grab one of these two settings here Euro zero latency or if you want quality go with this setting and you're just gonna pin that let's say I want to do this one here I'm gonna copy that and I'm going to append that at the very end here. So again, 
after you copy the first set of this here, you're going to do space and then you're going to do control V and then you're going to add that there and then you're going to apply the settings. Um, and then that's pretty much it. So if you have a low-end computer, you'll be able to uh, record your FPS, your games. And um, this is very handy because a lot of what I do testing are on low-end computers and I want to avoid using my smartphone to record the screen and be able to do everything off of the computer. But that's it. Stay tuned. I'm going to show you now the screenshots of everything that I just talked about. Make sure you follow that closely and let me know if, if you have any questions. Okay, so here comes the screenshots and uh, just make sure you follow along uh, and let me know if you have any qu questions. So here are the screenshots right now. Thank you.